hey everyone I'm back with another video today what I'm going to be showing you is how I made these super glamorous slides if you want to see how I made these just keep on watching For the first pair, you'll need some white slides, some jewelry trim, a pair of scissors, and some E6000 glue. Here's an up close of the jewelry trim I'm using. It's so gorgeous. It has rhinestones and jewels on it. I picked this up at Hobby Lobby. So after I cut the trim into squares, I'm just going to lay it against the slide to get an idea of where I want it to lay. I'm going to take my E6000 glue and begin gluing each square onto the slide in a checkered pattern. This is the quick precaution when you're using E6000 glue. I've heard the fumes can be harmful, so make sure you open a window or something to get some fresh air in when you're using the glue. You can use a glue gun instead, but all I had was E6000 glue to use. For the next pair, I'm using pink slides, some gold jewelry trim, and E6000 glue. Here's the up close of the gold jewelry trim I'm using. I wanted the trim to fall on the slides in a zigzag pattern, so here I am just lining it up to get an idea of how it's going to look. I'm going to put some E6000 glue directly on the slide and then take my trim and lay it over top. The spacing doesn't have to be super perfect. I just eyeballed it as I was laying my trim over top and they still came out great. For the last pair, I'm using black slides, some jewelry stickers, and some E6000 glue. Here's an up close of these gorgeous jewelry stickers I'm using. I started laying the jewels on the slide. I didn't have an exact idea of how I wanted each piece to lay, so I just freelanced it. Now these jewels do stick on their own. I just felt that it would be more secure if I used the E6000 glue. And there you have it, some glamorous slides that are also super affordable. Each pair cost me less than 15 bucks to make with the slides and the jewels included. I will make sure to link as much as I can in the description box. As usual, if you have any comments or questions, Feel free to leave them in the comment section and I'll catch you guys in my next video.